Good morning, everybody. Today is January 11th, a Wednesday. And the guys are busy today. Uh, finishing up this top little spot. And the guys are doing cleanup because we are going to lose a lot of the guys today. They're going to go back home. I think Foreman actually has another job waiting for them. So anyways, let's go take a look around and see what everybody's up to. So by the end of the day, all this white sand isn't going to be here. It's actually going to get moved. I think all these sacks of sand and gravel are going to be moved. And we have a fill pile too with a little leftover dirt. Me and my little nephew are going to do some projects here shortly. Well, the storage room and where the water is going to be. The guys are working hard. The scaffolding is supposed to be picked up today. Uh, originally, it was supposed to be yesterday, but they uh, scheduled for today again. So we'll see if they pick it up today. All right. And downstairs, the welder's working on the entrance gate, uh, putting the lock on it. And we got Foreman busy over here. We have our drain for the water and the plumbing. Once we pour this, we can put the pressure tank in and get it all set up. All right, let's take a look in here. This is what I've been waiting for. It's the walk on this. This is nice, not too much light, unfortunately, for you guys to see. But our step down, our step down, and they're building up the door framing. And to top it off, the foreman can take his time a little bit. Um, I think they're gonna actually pour that today before the guys go. But I still have parts. We changed our system up a little bit, so I have more parts coming. All right, so the guys already started moving some stuff around. I think that might be the foreman's bunk. Actually, it's a good idea. I saw his brother is, uh, said he uh, bought some uh, scaffolding and uses it for bunk beds for his kids, which works good. And it's not bad if you go to the junkyard and get them and clean it up. All right, good afternoon. We got the scaffolding inside, We're working on everything the guys are actually pretty busy it's about break time we brought them some spaghetti coke and some bread but this craziness is quite interesting it is pretty much almost all of our black water and gray water from upstairs down here it's a bit of a crazy mess to me. Uh, we're underneath all that, the second floor beams. There's still a lot more plumbing stuff to work on too. In the front half, inside the storage area has a bunch of stuff that still needs to be done. And there's some motors over here in the corners that still needs to be done. Uh, and our sand. Went right by that first time around, but there is our white sand. There's still got a little bit more white sand, and then we're gonna bring in gravel and then our uh, S1 sand. So we're gonna store it all in here so nothing walks away. All right, and here is the plastering. See, they still got lots of plumbing up here to do. I think they started over here for the plumbing, our electrical inlet. It's a bit of a crazy mess how, how it is. Under our house, you don't see it. Some of this you're gonna see. I know Foreman almost has this all ready to go too. I think they're gonna try to pour this at some point maybe 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 not today because i know they're uh doing cleanup right now and inside the storage area still polishing off everything and here we got our pprs and they're starting to 
plaster in the PPR sections too. For the toilet, the sink, the bidet, the shower. Alright, and here's what the outside's looking like. They've actually separated out some of the stuff. I think the foreman's gonna take. We told him to burn it, but I think he's gonna take some of the cocoa lumber and the and the scraps. I think these scraps he's gonna take with him. And I think the bamboo when uh, the jeepney comes and gets all of his his gear. I think it won't be for another week or so. He still has stuff to do and there's I think three other guys with him. And in here of course we're in the front right room. Oh, a long time ago Foreman was starting to work on this and then something came up and then hadn't gotten back to it. And back in the right room the same so oh, lots of PPR stuff needs to be done. Good morning everybody. Today is January 12th, Thursday. And we just got a lot of st little stuff going on. A little bit of plaster and a little bit of plumbing. Still clean up. Let me uh, show you all what is going on. All right, so here's what the lot looks like. Well, the two lots across. We're getting there. Not sure exactly uh, when the shack will get down. I sell Aston. I said tomorrow. Of course, the, that was the guys that were doing cleanup. So we have two labor. I think we have uh, one laborer and two skilled, three skilled left. And Foreman, I think, is uh, getting his other project going. All right, and cleaning up a little bit in here. That's the plumbing they were working on yesterday, the end of it, the end of the day. And our crazy plumbing that they did yesterday. And there is our white sand. I think that is some S1 right there. All right, everybody, good afternoon. It's time to see what has been done for the day. Got some, still got the same plumbing it's looking like we got going on. Over there, I, I think they did some up top. The welder's doing the little window. And in here, a little storage area. They're getting some plumbing done. This is all going to be done. And here in the left room, a little bit of plastering. I would suspect the rest of them are the same way, the plaster and all the countertops. Yeah, we're now in the front right room. Plastered these countertop, this countertop too. And nothing new in here other than that. Alright. Uh, that plastered and forming. He's on the laser level to run his PPR fittings. And in here, they have PPR set up. And in the back left room, they plastered this section counter and let's see no nope. uh, plumbing hasn't been put in in here yet all right everybody that is about it for this video i hope you all enjoyed it give
it a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed. And thank you for watching. And as always, goodbye.